Your mind is like a garage. Now, I'll give you this quick analogy, and it happens to be in my book. I'm a big Italian family, and uh, seven of us, four brothers, three sisters. I'm the youngest brother, and the only two sisters are younger than me, so I was pretty much the mama's boy. Hard to figure, right? <laughs> okay, so my brother's all these big Italian guys, right? So now we empty the whole garage out to help my father, take everything out, we sweep it, we sweep it and what do you think we do? Put everything back in a different position. And you got five Italians standing like this. Nice job, right? Okay. Now, we did absolutely nothing. Nothing. And you know the women are standing like this. Because she's got two bags that go in the garage, and it doesn't fit. Okay. So now what should we have done? We should have took something out of the garage that maybe Aunt Rose gave us. You know, Aunt Rose now is dead 10 years. But we're Italians. So as we're about to throw it in the garbage, whose voice do we hear from heaven? You better not. So I give it to my brother. He says, I ain't throwing it out. And it goes back on the shelf, right? Something the kids did when they were in kindergarten. Now they're 45. It's still in the garage, OK? So all this stuff is still sitting there. So you're not throwing nothing out because of superstition, because of guilt, whatever it is. Then you take the stuff out and you put it in the bag to give to the what? The charity. What do you do with the bag you're going to give to the charity? Back in the garage. I'm going to take it with me when I have time. Do you understand? And this is what you do in your mind's garage. All the stuff that's put in there, just like the other garage, is put in there by other people's gifts and things. Most of them are useless, but it's put in there. And you just felt you have to keep it. And that's what we do in our mind's garage. We accept all the stuff in there. It stays in there. There's no room in the mind's garage for new information. So you need to take out the old stuff. And there's a process to that. So now you can fit the new. 